This is Adrian Hart with your Southeast Colorado News on seconews.org. We're at the art project where Jars has this piece. Uh, my description is it's just banging. It's doing a lot. <laughs> I love it, dude. Yesterday, man, it was just a bunch of kids walking around all amazed, you know, infused. Yeah, I heard yesterday there were so many people walking through here, you didn't really have much room to work. It wasn't bad, but it was kind of, uh, you know, it was clustered. Yeah. Yeah, man. Hi, guys. Oh, you want to bomb my news? Hi, guys. Hi. Heck yeah. So, uh, is this your first year at the art project? Yeah, I was supposed to come last year, but I didn't, I didn't really have time to make it. Remember yesterday I regret, but, yeah, this is my first year here now, man. Yeah. Yeah, but you've been to Lahana before. Yeah. Yeah, I've been here. My uh, my uh, grandparents and my parents actually live in Avondale. So okay. Yeah, but uh, yeah. yeah so you're Valley local, we'll say. Yeah, there you go. Very nice, On dude. The edge, yeah. Valley wide, right here, bro. Uh, we got some Avondale users. We throw up some killer sunsets from Avondale, actually. Yeah, man. Yeah, it's beautiful up there. Uh, so yeah, tell us about your first experience painting in the art project, bro. Man, it was amazing, bro. I fucking. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I can edit. <laughs> <laughs> I got a, I got to be placed over here by these homies, uh, views and east, and uh, man, they killed it. And yeah. Over here, I was, I mean, trying to, you know, do my own thing and stuff and whatnot. But I asked them initially if I could just kind of base off of their yeah. ideas, their color scheme and stuff, and they were cool with this. So like, Heck yeah, might as well make it match, and they're, they they're, both really pop. They're very humbling, bro, to be over here by good artists like that. So it's a, uh, it was all like, overall, it was a sick experience. Man. It's crazy. Very cool. But yeah, it's definitely uh, coming back next year. Yeah, <laughs> I don't even have to ask. <laughs> you just throw it out, man. Well, we're happy to have you. This is really a crazy piece. Uh, adding those extra outlines, making each letter really kind of stand on its own. Yeah, it's kind of simple letters. Um, I'm still like getting back into the mix of graffiti. I used to do it when I was a lot younger, but uh, just getting the, the form of letters and stuff, you know what I mean? I get a lot of inspiration from different artists and, and I kind of just try to make it into my own. So I had this one sketched, but once I seen their color scheme, I was like, all right, dude, we're going to get... Like, we're going to switch it up. They do their letters too, man. Yeah. And everybody here, man, killed it, you know? Yeah. Everybody here, I went and walked around and talked to everybody, so... It was cool, man. It was, a, it was definitely a crazy experience, bro. Yeah. Very honored to be here, like I was telling Khan. Yeah. Well, we're very honored to have you uh, throw it down for Lahana like this. Yeah, man. I'm this is going to catch people off of 3rd Street. Uh, everyone wants to see what's new anyways. Uh, but when people don't know about the art project, these pieces on the end of the alleyway really grab the attention. No, I've seen it. That's why I put it here. I was placing it, and uh, I like kind of stepped back over it. I was like, "Wait, dude, I'm in the center." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I didn't know it was gonna be so big. You know, like initially, I was like, "Oh damn." You got a lot of room. Yeah, I got a lot of room to work with. But, um, so yeah, uh, is this the only art you do? You got a uh, history and graffiti art. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually tattoo. I tattoo in uh, Pueblo, Colorado. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Grayscale Tattoo Collective uh, Union in downtown. downtown nice. Uh, I, 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 that's what kind of like lost me for a lot of years was this tattooing um, and kind of being obsessed with that. But um, I dig it. It's falling into the art form and doing what's paying the bills. If you can do that and make art, that's living the dream, right? For sure, bro. Like, that's, that's the goal, you know? Just yeah. Pay the bills and yeah. That is beautiful. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Anything you want to throw out? You got an Insta? Yeah. Uh, you can follow me at uh, jars underscore T-A-T-2 on Instagram. Okay. And uh, just Jared Soto on Facebook. You can see a lot of my art on there, too. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it, man. I just kind of stick to the social media. I really have a website or anything. Not yet, anyways. So. Yeah. We'll throw up some videos and 
share your art you're sharing with Lon. Oh man, I got here in time to catch the drip. <laughs> yeah, bro. That is drippy, bro. Hell yeah. Anything else you want to add? Um, no, nah, man. Shit. Like I said, thank you for having me and I hope you like the art. Absolutely. Oh, yeah. That oh, is man. tight, dude. Yeah. Thank you for coming. Right you got to do the fist bump there. Oh, Hell Broncos. yeah. <laughs> right on, go Broncos. It is Sunday, after all, at the Art Project in downtown La Junta with your Southeast Colorado News. For Jars, Zeke, and the rest of the crew, I'm Adrian Hart.